Hi everyone, this is Lo, I'm back and I had a problem with microphone and I had some pretty important uh, footage recorded without my voice but that's not really a big disaster but it does mean you missed <laughs> just a little bit of explanation about what, what's been done <coughs> Of camera. Um, also, don't be scared about amount of mind stuff. It's because I wasn't even able to record for a pretty long time, um, and that's why I wasn't doing much progress, in, pretty much intentionally. Instead, instead I was uh, experimenting with tools, and uh, I gotta explain about it. So I made a bigger smeltery, uh, made <clears throat> what about smeltery? pretty much nothing I added a modifier of reinforced of each on each of my pickaxes uh, what else um, I was uh, duplicating uh, slime in Thumbcraft uh, using Thumbcraft al alchemy in that crucible and it's water artichoke and berries uh, that are ingredients for duplication that's why I'm growing so many of them um, and I have some slime crystals here still going but yeah, I have some shovels that uh, picked up luck and I don't really like it, it's useless, but all of my sho shovels still picking up luck. Uh, so I have this flint pickaxe, I tried to level it up, um, I made it reinforced uh, 3 from beginning and it uh, got reinforced 1 as a upgrade and I added one lapis to it so it can grow it's now three lapis and uh, mine speed is four for this flint pickaxe and that's pretty shitty and <laughs> this <laughs> wow it's actually mining speed 16 just a netherrack pickaxe it has less durability usually but Right now, effective durability is huge. I mastered it uh, because basically, when you get a new one, it has almost like I know ten or ten or nine speed compared to speed four. It and I got um, diamond on it, so I can mine everything. And stonebound, uh, you can see um, where is it? Stonebound bonus is 252, maximum bonus is 3.0, which means it can mine much faster when it has lower durability. Uh, there is my cobalt pickaxe, and has reinforced seven, and I don't use it that often anymore um, because. Right now, only good thing about it is mining level. You can see speed is almost identical, but this netherrack one has one more level of redstone. Basically, it's very good pickaxe. Um, so I try to keep. I want to have uh, this cobalt pickaxe that I almost never repair and netherrack tools. I don't want to have flint tools, but I have the shovel steel mine speed 19 compared to 15 for some reason um, But this one actually is slimy sometimes when you mine something it spawns slimes and it actually even smallest slimes can damage you and that's very annoying and you, you actually can get slime for killing them but it's, it is annoying I almost finished my wall I just need to uh, finish the underwater part 
Um, I've done a huge amount of digging because I didn't really know what to do if I'm off camera. Yeah, I dug all of it and not exactly sure what I'm gonna do with it, but um, it wasn't for nothing. Uh, kind of unfortunate. I basically all I wanted a place for my trees uh, to plant them and so they can sit here and never grow any fruits because they suck so I had to put three of each kind and they still growing really really slow the trees itself still not growing I gave them a lot of time so I have cherry, avocado, pear, uh, coconuts, uh, walnuts and gooseberry. Wish I had more walnuts. Uh, I'm actually not sure but I think recipes with them can be good. Yeah so water artichoke, still farming uh, this cotton. I've done some fishing and found those both, which very unfortunate they can't use them. Um, I was hoping some to find some enchanted books, stuff like that. About wild chickens, I read that um, in order to convert a wild uh, into normal, you just have to actually breed them enough. But honestly, it's not working yet because I think. Wait, what? Nice, we have a chicken. It's actually happened exactly while I was recording, but we, we had to get a lot of chicken to randomly get one uh, normal chicken. Um, basically, through generations you will eventually get one uh, normal. We have so much coal, coal here that it didn't even fit the double chest, so I had to put it in the drawer and have a full drawer here. Um, Put some more drawers uh, here, a lot of them are full because I've been mining here for, for quite a long time and uh, this is still going. Small, uh, small iron, let's connect, collect. Nice. Um, so we have decent amount of iron and probably can get um, cooking tools at any moment we have 15 crushed iron ore uh, 5 nuggets 9 piles and mm, 4 tracks is like one and a half of ingot so it's like two ingots here and four ingots here I'm not sure I, I don't really feel big need for good food yet um, and I'm not sure if I will uh, finally discover that I need iron for something Now we even have a lot of fruit uh, growing, although it's very slow, it's still pretty cool. We, we maybe need to see if we can use rubber for something, but all that is not for now, I guess. So yeah, all I've been doing messing around with those um, tools and actually uh, s uh, putting um, slime handle on uh, 
on a tool uh, supposed to increase its durability about 80% like with this pickaxe it has pretty much double durability 80% compared to the netherrack of course so it has double durability but for the tools that have um, uh, durability booster from diamond uh, it durability booster is not getting affected so effect is much lower when you put uh, this handle on a uh, tool with a diamond I guess what's next is that we should work on our spawn spawning areas um, and I, I done some suicide exploration um, uh, around this area uh, where I already was exploring and was looking closer on the to trying to find tin and some exploration to the top I found uh, pigs and kobolds uh, that's a mob from witchery Eldritch, Witch Circles, uh, Sinister Nodes, Skeleton Spawner, uh, Druids from uh, Ars Magica, Giant Raspberry Bushes, yeah, here, and Double Loot Spiders, more Loot Spiders, I mean, that's a spawner, Great Wood uh, Tree with a spawner. Uh, wild cows and yeah I said I should work on our area but wild cows is something that we need just as much because it's really holding me back not having any portable inventory especially with a mod pack with nerfed uh, stacks and weight mechanic not having portable inventory really sucks because basically portable inventory means that we are cheating uh, weight mechanic I mean it's intended but the cost is that we is, the cost is pretty high I guess so we still can't make it happen so sun is setting I will prepare to go and I think we will uh, head towards cows and I'm not sure how I'm going to bring cows uh, to our home but I really should try to do it somehow yeah also I already told the creeper killed all my sheep against except one Annoying. We also need. Ah, oh, shit. We need something to do to protect against against spiders. Maybe something to do to our fans. I could uh, breed chicken again, chicken again, but the whole trick is actually to wait until they grow, so you have a chance to breed new population, new generation. I mean, generation. So I guess it was small overview of what has been done. Did I found something new on the bottom? Probably not. Small copper ores, which I marked, because I'm getting desperate for copper. Yeah, another vein. Bismuth cows. But nothing too interesting. I mean, technically, one chicken is already enough to get as much chicken as I want but that's probably will be super slow because of because I will need to collect eggs from that chicken and try to spawn another chicken
Yeah, ideal would be to dig a tunnel to that uh, place where cows are. Not actually that far. Maybe that's what I will do because I don't want to travel above the ground. Keeping some of this infused stone for later when I have luck or corrupting. Corrupting is even better than the luck. Of course, better have luck and corrupting. <laughs> so, okay. Um, that's it for now. I haven't been exploring Nether or um, Twilight Forest yet, but I really want to. I just don't know what I should do first, and I think first now is um, leather. Uh, what footage that I recorded without voice uh, mostly been done uh, doing stuff here. You can see I'm working with witch spawners. I have a small house here, kind of house, just a covered area. Um, not much important because everything going very slowly but i mean what i will have from that is uh, resources from mob spawns uh, hopefully uh, loot bags from thumbcraft that can have all kind of resources but right now i want portable inventory and there are two items of portable inventory that i can get it's a knapsack Uh, really easy to get for me right now. I certainly have the. F it wasn't disabled before. What the actual hell? Why you would disable anything? You just should increase the cost. I really uh, start to actually don't like this pack. Okay, we have, we don't have knapsack. What about backpack? We still have backpack. It's it it, it costs even less. You just have to get leather. Um, is there anything that? Anything else? Slime, slimeling inventory bag, reinforced iron chest. That's that's that does cost a bit, be and we actually can't make it because for block of iron we need compressor. That's that's better. That's much better. Like you need compressor for this, and nine slimes, and a diamond. That's that's a nice recipe. You need compressor. It could be make even made even had harder, but we don't even know how much storage it is. Maybe it's nerfed. Uh, golden bag. Oh, yeah, golden bag of holding is pretty much impossible to make because it's thumbcraft, and for thumbcraft you need uh, thumbnomicon. There is an alternative way though, we don't, we may not actually need a thermometer, gotta pronounce it right, if we get uh, knowledge fragments, but to get knowledge fragments we need to kill a ton of different stuff and hope to get it from loot bags. Hmm, so... I don't see any other kind of portable inventory. Um, thought forestry had a 
or it wasn't a forestry but there were all kind of bags and they could be upgraded in the forestry related oh i'm scrolling all the way Twilight Forest looks uh, very interesting and I wonder what's about ore generation there and slime islands. There also can be spawners in that dimension. Oh, here is a woven silk that I was uh, looking for. We need assembly for that. And very few recipes for it okay so for now i tr will try to prepare myself and go for cows so see ya someday soon also ah, whatever i'm growing cotton mostly for the seeds because they have uh, some thumbcraft uh, um, permutatio aspect but right now they are pretty useless, okay. Cutting it down now. So I found couple cows and... They used to follow me but they don't follow any further. Maybe they are a bit too fat for that. Uh, I need to do the other side because of torches. Let's test. Come on, let's go cow, and you as well, everyone just go, don't tell me you can't even fit through here, that's something new for me, yeah, they definitely can't fit, so let's breed them here and in the meantime, we need what the hell they don't like me watch them breeding or something <sighs> that actually was um. I know, it was surprising. I didn't expect them to attack me. I don't think I attacked them as well. I was holding mouse. Should not be able to <clears throat> hit them. When they're angry, they actually sh usually show up as um, angry on the on the map. So we actually have one here. Let's just go ahead and uh, work with that. Well, actually. In all honesty, we need to check twice if I had all, all my... If I got all my things. Let's eat food and see if something else was there. It doesn't look like it. Let's go back to the cows. Mm, where did one cow go?
Yes, we now have only one cow. Actually, one cow and a baby cow, so that's cool. We can push one cow and a baby cow will follow. Okay, if I just walk, it's actually fine. <laughs> nice. And the baby is following us behind, we can see it on the minimap. Oh no. We are close, let's slow down a little bit. Yeah, I also found uh, barite, um, certus quartz and quartz uh, vein on the way. And it's pretty useless, I don't think I can even make anything from it. Okay, you don't want to jump, don't you? What about now? Doesn't look like it. Uh, that's cobalt. It's netherrack. And where's my shovel? Looks like baby cow would like to follow me into his new home. But the adult one is not so happy. Oh, come on. Do you really so tall? have to put a torch here anyway. Did I lost my torches? No, I didn't. Okay. Okay, so I hope this will work out. And I will not have to bring any more. So we have a couple of cows here, I, I can't even try and feed this one, so it grows faster, looks like it's not an option. Um, so when this uh, Nezrak pickaxe is going down in durability, yeah it's almost as fast as my Cobble pickaxe, but not quite, but that's fine. So we have cows and apparently that will take a couple ages until we, until baby cow will grow, then, uh, then what? After baby cow grows, we need to breed them a couple times, about four or five times, maybe more because it's hard to explain, but 
we could be breeding wrong uh, uh, things. And instead of breeding breeding children with each other like a new generation, we can uh, random we, because we don't know we randomly breed them all. We can breed the uh, parents again and get say more of the same children. Waiting for them to grow. Um, meantime, I don't even know what I can do in the meantime. I could just go and kill all other cows, but um, that's efficient and fast. But that's scary. What if my cows will die for some reason? I could check chickens because chickens is uh, first thing that I will domesticate apparently. We have one chicken here. Let's see if it will actually breed with other chickens. Let's just breed them all and hope that we get another chicken. Maybe this mod can utilize actual name tags, so you can see who you did breed and who you didn't breed. We have one chicken here and one, two small chickens. So it does work. It's awesome. We have ton of feathers. Gardens are not spreading. Maybe they do spread in the biome where they supposed to be. But I planted gardens that I have the most of and they don't spread. Okay. I do want to have another ship. I think I killed quite a lot of them <laughs> when I had my own ship here and now I have only one and that sucks. Okay, so that's it for now. If something else interesting happens, we'll resume recording. For now, I just need to do other stuff uh, other than Minecraft. So see you next time, guys. Okay, I'm back. Um, I'm still waiting for cows to grow. And I went uh, and decided to mine out a bit of uh, diamond vein, vein with graphite and uh, coal here. And I found the floor of... Um, how does it call? Um, rogue dungeon. I'm not even sure how, what I'm gonna do with that. But it's very curious to try and work with that and mine, uh, mine everything out in the end. Maybe all those mobs on the map are related to this rogue dungeon. And what I also think... Um, we kind of need to... make finally our better uh, food tools because and work a little bit more on the food so we have better food oh my god works work never stops in this pack 
I just wanted to check how much actual diamonds we have in that vein. To clear out my inventory. What else can we put out? This pickaxe, maybe this mattock. Or actually, we'll do that. I will leave only netherrack tools. I kind of want to keep one with me. Uh, don't need to keep uh, having wheat. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put that wheat next to cows. Probably still didn't grow. Oh, actually they did. Let's see. Still gonna stick this uh, here. So nice. We're growing cows now, finally. That means chickens should finally grow as well. They they took a lot of time to grow. Um, I still don't see two chickens anywhere. It's actually becoming a danger zone here. Because of the amount of wild chickens, they keep suffocating in the wall. But that's actually some... Uh, it's kind of an automatic way to kill them. Oh shit, hunger, 30 seconds, still didn't grow, I have only one adult chicken. Okay, so I'm gonna continue mining on the bottom there, I'm not gonna go into the rogue dungeon, but um I might like mine everything around it and see where the rooms are I can then find a way to light them up just by filling them with lava or something or just uh, I can put lamps maybe we can later on check if uh, Those guys can break redstone lamp. Oh, I actually can't make redstone lamp. I don't think I have redstone. But we gotta find something. Oh, I can just straight up put glowstone. And that's kind of um, costly, but... I can go ahead and try to mine more. Hmm. This pickaxe can't mine this. So there are actually ah uh, things that uh, this netherrack pickaxe can't mine. That's fine. After all, it's super cheap netherrack. And that means that I will only use this cobalt pickaxe to mine um, something like this um, cinnabar. So yeah, I'm gonna continue mining here and uh, shit, I'm doing it wrong way. I think I should have left uh, three spaces in between and mine one above. I still have to like mine like this anyway, I think. 
and then fix what I did wrong. Oh yeah, here it is. Uh, stuff already spawned in there. Gotta make sure that I'm safe here. But yeah, basically we're gonna work with that. <clears throat> but mm, the mo main thing I need is portable inventory right now. I'm really hoping to get leather for that and... I'm gonna go come back when that's done. Okay, I got my first egg and we will wait a little bit for countdown on those chickens. Okay, this one without countdown and this one as well. Fun. One second countdown, 300 seconds. 300 seconds. This one seems to be without countdown. Yeah, and I got my first egg, so I assume they give eggs. They all have, um, a lot of them have yellow, red health. I actually might be hoping that they will die by themselves because they will suffocate in the walls so much. Uh, Oh, chicken. Is there another one? Uh, without the countdown? Don't think so. Yeah, they take a while to grow. About 1200 seconds. But we are starting to get eggs, which is really awesome. So. Oh, there are stuffed pepper light meal. I wonder if I can just go ahead and make more of this bakeware. And we can sort of kinda we will need bricks anyway. I maybe only make a couple more. <clears throat> but I think we should uh, make our food storage somewhere, maybe in the back of this farm here. Uh, mine out that space or <laughs> actually Maybe it's better to use space that we already dug out, but I was all the time. But anyway, I have to find the place for kitchen and uh, we still have a ton of iron. Maybe we can uh, convert tracks as well. I think they don't have any recipes. We also later on will need more grout to make more portable tanks from Tinker's Construct. So we do have quite a lot of this crushed iron ore and impure as well. But I'm not sure. Also, I don't know if we can do something interesting with witchery. Never actually done 
much of witchery. Oh, there is kettle, witches, cauldron. Oh, you have to do it basically a cauldron with annoying paste. Should be able to find it. And where the hell is uh, Witch's Owen? It's on Thomonomenomicon. Okay, so we can start Witchery before Thumbcraft. Uh, I mean, yeah, we can. That's correct. We already have cauldron for Thumbcraft. We will need iron for Thaumium eventually, but that's not coming anytime soon because we will need bronze blast furnace first. And I think that does mean that we um, basically can use our iron. Well, shit. Okay, let's test uh, one th something. Let's test something. There are those coal nuggets. I have eight coal nuggets. How do they work? Do they just smelt one item? Wow, that's fucking OP. How do they stack? 64. Wow, that's cool. I I was doing the business of like putting cobble to finish up a stone. Uh, I mean, if I smelt one item, I was like try harding and uh, putting stuff into the furnace so I only lose one um, and not everything it's hard to explain and now I know that the, this thing is existing in this pack where you can just uh, uh, uncraft a coal and you get eight things that can smelt one, I one item each Oh, actually, nuggets don't uh, stack stack better. I thought they stack only by um, um, thirty two, that like it was in previous version of this pack. That's also nice. Yeah, my fruits are slowly growing. Maybe we we will need more nutmegs um, or walnuts. Walnuts, I think they called walnuts. Uh, these guys, uh, because you need them for cooking oil. I I don't know if cooking oil is very like important, but it's used for salad dressing and from for other shit. So it's probably pretty important. So we are processing most of our iron. I guess that's is enough for now. <clears throat> and tracks uh, let's check again for sure yeah no recipes that can be any kind of useful so we have three ingots here out of eight tracks two tracks won't give me full ingot so 
I'd rather not. <sighs> because it will uh, pollute my smell tree basically. I will have nuggets hanging out there and I don't know if that way something useless can get an alloy there. Mining level 10. Like uh, I I saw an Angmalen here and looks like it doesn't even have an alloy. So it's uh, mixing manually or something. Oh, it has its own ore. Maybe I'm... Um, maybe I'm confusing it with something else, but... I think in, in Blightfall it was alloys that you could, could get from gold... Uh, And iron, and if you have go um, iron or gold in your smeltery, and then you put some iron or gold, well, you understand. If they some somehow get uh, together in the smeltery, you can get <clears throat> you can lose your gold and get some useless metal I don't know we can stick those um, crafting station somewhere here for now so again uh, we need um, We need to get kind of um, infinite amount of each uh, good food because that is easier to manage rather than just crafting it all the time. So we need uh, this. Let's collect some of these because I think I never actually ate any of the seaweed or other thing eggplant onions pumpkins we have done a lot of mutations and i think we'll have to do that again <laughs> by the way i know it sucks but we don't have to but it's probably the more efficient way if we if i get um seeds and carrots uh, to 10 10 10 okay we have stuffed pepper nice I can eat it great and next one is 64% that sucks what about tech plant it requires butter and um, an egg so as, so we are starting to get eggs here and butter needs heavy cream and heavy cream needs milk so we can't do that yet stuffed mushroom that's cheese also made out of milk oh well whatever let's see if we passed the cooldown chickens does look like it oh I can't see anything
So they are on a cooldown, I guess, and no longer can breed. We're getting a lot of feathers, but not enough uh, other things. Yeah, the, and of course we have to look on the recipes care more careful. Maybe we will find more stuff that we can do. Of course we will. And um, gardens don't grow. I should try other types. Okay, so original cow have this hut which is extremely useful so we feed this one and this one nice and uh, 12 hundred seconds 12 it actually should be easy to figure out how many minutes is this but I, I, I think I will not try to <sighs> okay, so yeah, we actually need to start doing the thing of creating <laughs> I guess I will do just this and we need sticks And first of all, we'll make pot. That will help us get salt. Uh, we need also a um, yeah. This we need. Uh, Uh, cutting board Cutting board um, What else? I don't even know what that does. Presser, it's steel. Market oven. It's actually iron. Oh, advanced. Advanced. And advanced. And that's aluminum. Uh, and we need, yeah, we need skillet. Actually, we have. Jo oh, I thought we have just enough. Uh, I actually didn't use my... Yeah, I didn't even use nuggets. So we need a skillet. Where is that? And I think that will be it here. We don't need anything else unless we...
I don't know, at least for now we don't need anything else. That's that's cool. Because I mean we can make we can turn it in, into raw raw iron, like better iron. But I don't know if there is any like benefit of doing that. So we actually should be having like a kitchen-ish uh, thing here. We can, we can click any of those crafting station. And if I have uh, things in my inventory to cook with, I can just uh, pull here and do that. So uh, we can make whole bunch of jelly. Not sure, not even sure that's worth it. What a melon jelly, but they all are like don't give don't give much hunger, so I'm not sure if it's worth it. Yeah, oh, this my. I think I should uh, get a ton of fruit um, punch from this cantaloupe because th those cantaloupes are super useless in any other way. I think. Also, let's go and check something. Uh, I've been told that there is a bug that turns... If you try to harvest um, water from Ars Magica, it will be with a regular... No, with a... Ah, with a clay bucket, it will turn into iron bucket. Let's check if that's true. Wow, you, you actually just get liquid ethereum like that, I thought. And we get also an iron bucket. I want a bit of this liquid and want to study its, its properties and what it does to entities. Does it prevent spawn or what it does? Like if I do that, it does prevent spawn, but at the same time you can like walk there pretty easily and it will not interrupt you even if it's flowing, I think. But we will need to check to be more sure. So we have extra iron bucket and I'm not gonna um, exploit it too much, just this one extra bucket. Gardens are still not growing. This bush is still not growing, maybe leaving the berries on it is not a good strategy, maybe I should collect berries. Those guys really want to get out. So how much left? Maybe half? Half? No! I guess 1200 seconds is really a lot. Um, and these guys are ready to be bred. Uh, we, we can breed them again. We are getting some meat. We are getting a bit of lag. 
Uh, well, actually, last few, last like 10 minutes, I get more lag than I usually do. Let's hope that this worked and we got some more chickens. Cows will have to wait a bit longer for cows. So we have this um, stuffed pepper recipe going and we can just put more ingredients and get more of this. Uh, shape crafting, shapeless crafting and let's see if we can do something else here like something that's cheap. Uh, well, here we go, cooking oil, garlic chicken, that's a good recipe. Wow, and you know what, we can go ahead and turn that into cooking oil, but no, we gonna plant more of this shit, underground, because we don't really have so much space above the ground. I think uh, this should be a perfect place. So we have, we need to go at least two blocks from the walls, I think. And then, God. We, we don't have to be very generous. That should be enough. So all of our cooking oil we basically spent and spent and hoping to get more cooking oil. Oh, so by the way, maybe I can check here. So if I turn the stone there, it does not um, make it flow. It just flows by itself. It does not prevent spawn around it. But it does prevent spawn where it's flo flowing. Freaking Enderman noises. Oh, come on. I'm a little bit scared of him. Oh shit, my mattock is not level up, not leveled up. Oh. Why are you fucking running away? Why it has double HP? I mean, if we are here, we certainly not getting killed. Off. Recklessness. Doesn't doesn't sound too scary. He certainly was swift. Come on, dude.
I hope you can drop some balls. Some ender balls. Where is your berserk sprint? Okay, so I'm gonna finish off with a uh, what? Where's my lucky pickaxe? Should have used shovel though, but it's gone. It's freaking gone. I was greedy. I should have punched him to death. Oh shit. I'm gonna find you. Where are you? Did he just run away after killing me? Ah. Who would have thought? Oh, come on. Why are you not jumping? Okay. Look, it looks like we have all our uh, all of our things here. Hopefully, didn't lose anything. Looks like that guy just uh, ran away, getting more eggs. That's awesome. Yeah, that's annoying. I killed one enderman before and didn't drop anything. Cooldown is still there. Not exactly sure what we should do next. Uh, getting sheep would be awesome, but you have to go outside for that. I guess I will take a break from recording. Maybe we should actually repair at least once. Just to be sure. I don't want to repair it completely because it will slow down the pickaxe, of course. It will soon have one uh, level of uh, luck. Okay. Anyway, we gotta work on... I, I was... Uh, there was some recipe with garlic, right? Garlic and this. Yeah, cooking oil. We need to wait f f until we get more cooking oil. Uh, it might be that some of them did grow. I'm not sure how to make them grow faster. Uh, I watched other guys stream who tried to do agri-craft, he actually went straight for the <laughs> sprinkler and he couldn't craft um, the, the channel that's supposed to give water to, sprin to sprinkler and it does look like sprinkler only attaches to this channel and that's basically fucked up because all recipes told him that he can do it but in reality he wasn't able to okay
Oops. I think I... I should stop recording now. <laughs> okay. I hope that shit wasn't on my screen all the time. Uh, yeah. But that doesn't really matter. Okay, so... I will come back later. Need to take a break from recording. Hi everyone, this is Law, and <clears throat> by putting shit around your Thumbcraft research table, you can get um, um, aspects, primal aspects, like I got Water, Ignis, Ordo, Terra, and also just used Air to complete this research. I, I needed Perdicio, one, one of Perdicio, but I couldn't get it. I'm trying furnaces, trying heads, trying cobble, but nothing works so far. I don't know what can give me Perdition. I don't know, like, uh, maybe flash block or graveyard soil. I don't know. Block of flesh. Gotta try it. So yeah, we, we did another research of a hungry chest. Don't have Thomonomonomicon on me. By the way, I made this. It's cost a bunch of planks, I mean slabs. Um, and some chest, chest, some wood, and four iron, and I make some annoying recipes here. For example, uh, uh, when you do whatever recipe with a ton of buckets, it's really annoying to uh, because they don't stack. But if you have this, you can easily make any kind of recipe like that usually I make wow oh, usually I ba basically make all of my recipes like that actually different salt here I'm curious if it can do either um, usually I make all recipes of with this forestry thingies I basically have a like whole floor filled with them I like them No, I can't. What? Whatever. I uh, have full floor filled with them. I like them. and But they cost 4 iron. So in that case, I just have only one for now and use it for emergency. Mm. So what else <coughs> I got? Uh, some agricraft tools, clipper and iron handrake, they both cost 8 iron to uh, be crafted, so I might demonstrate them. Mostly clipper though. So clipper can duplicate plants like that, it's not 100%. Um, chance like you can see only one was successful chance depending on the strength or of, of a plant but well of course also random I just got some junk I don't have a trash can but I have a chest for that purpose mm. and I need to do the same here I can easily demonstrate uh, this uh, handrake maybe, well actually, wow, when, we, when you want weeds they are actually not happening, um, uh, let's go and see if flash block helped, 
we still not getting perdicia perdito and we need to start getting some anything else uh where did i place it i have some other research is going so we can slowly research stuff water transmutation it sounds useless and it's probably is useless so yeah the problem is that i have only five entropy shards and that's not enough for for a crystal it looks like no weeds so <clears throat> as i said no weeds as you need them oops shit i didn't want to do that um okay we'll see um also something to remember as uh, this work table crushed me twice while i was doing fresh water um when i shift right click to shift right click to craft them all so it, it works fine if you do it slowly but if you do them all at once it will probably crush the game so be careful and well actually very laggy time to time okay where is my thomanomenomicon i can't believe i can can't find it i've died a whole bunch of times by the way so it's possible that it's gone like forever and we will have to make another one but i'm just hoping that i lost it somewhere ah i made um, all the tools so when i have ingredients i can just go ahead and put stuff here well except the pot unfortunately and like make food here easy <sighs> where the hell i could possibly lo lose my thaumomicon come on that's not possible Oh, here it is with all the books so we need um, some paper and um, scribing tools yeah we're not getting well too bad shard transmit oh recrystallization Mm. There was shard transmutation somewhere. We can try to get furnace. That would be awesome. Oh well, actually, we need um, another van wand for it to work. So very important uh, golems. How can I still <laughs> not have something? I guess I know what's there. But I don't know what it's made of. It's ma machina, machina or whatever you pronounce it. Is it made out of? tool and uh, I guess I'm gonna google it
it's motus and instrumentum so instrumentum needs order we will have order also it's need humanus we don't we don't have neither of these so it will take quite a lot of time so we need spiritus do we have spiritus no we don't that means we need more mortals and so we need double victors okay so eventually we should be able to do that shit and as one of my viewers correctly pointed out you can also use knowledge fragments if you somehow was able to get them i guess i don't you don't really need knowledge fragments uh, Entropic refining. I need to find this shard transmutation be beforehand. Shadow metal. What? Whatever, just get it and go. Or oh, here we go, shard transmutation. Is it hard? Yeah, it's 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 might not be as hard as we think. Mm. But right now we just need a lot of other stuff. That's actually very. Um, I want to try and solve it like you can go here then like that that's pretty easy we don't have herba uh, and it's, we can make it Uh, that's obvious but we need to wait for Terra actually we will try and craft this one ah uh, here we go Terra so we have Victus here this is fucked up Aqua and Fire uh, Connecting here might be hard as well. We need two more order. I'm getting order here for absolutely no reason, but let's go. Maybe with that. Oh, come on. I hate when it doesn't work sometimes in this pack. So, Ordo, we need two Ordo. It's not happening. Is something here uses uh, Permutatio as a com compound of Permutatio? Probably not. I never actually seen, seen something that uses it. Maybe, maybe I'm just completely wrong. Okay, so next we need to connect this fire with this thing. It's probably... Probably not with this, but... Who knows? Because... We actually, we actually like have fire to do that and then we if we get air back again we can 
if you get two air well whatever we can do whatever we want because this also needs another order so I'm just gonna wait here for order I guess Maybe that way it will work faster, I don't know. Ah. Come on. Metalum. Here we go, we have Ordo that we will have to put in here. We will need another Ordo here. And then something that has Ordo will have to go there. I actually don't have anything. We can finish connecting this right now. Here we go, order. And we will need another order to craft uh, the thing. Oh my god. But can I do without this order? Oh, I can. Right. I need to connect Ignis now. I can use easy to connect to through this. From what we have, what else have Ignis? Probably nothing. Okay, we need Ordo and Ignis. And we connect. Or do we need to connect there? As it's actually will be our last connection and we're already crafting an aspect for it, so let's go short transmutation. Oh shit. That's that's actually doable, but that's expensive. So we need a per perditio shard. Okay. So to make a perditio shard, we can use a regular shard and um, put that shard with um, like one of these seeds right one yeah and two perditio which is two cobble that's my transmutation recipe when I will have um, the needed thing okay carrots oh no weeds and sometimes they gl glitch but it's now free of weeds so they ate my potatoes ah, whatever i kind of need to do those potatoes but we'll have to do it later so uh, we need to remember the recipe for those shards that's water uh, all six aspects uh, two of all six aspects of actually fern it has terra and uh, uh, herba and air just like grass yeah so it's useless um, um, we, have, we have whole bunch of good food here that we crafted 
but we're gonna use all of our shitty food because good food is for traveling or just the places outside of our house uh, where we can't have shitty food so again so we need two cobblestone again and that will do us on a That will do us on um, Perditio and Terra. Sh two sugar canes will do air and water. What else left? Air, water, Perditio. We need Ordo. We need two Ordo. <sighs> Hope I don't need to do some chisel shit. And I don't know what has order. Obviously, I'm not going to waste order shards. Mm. Order. What might have Ordo? Oh, of course, uh, Candleberries have Ordo. So we have Ordo, Air, Water, Perdidio and Shed. But we also need Ignis. But I don't know how much Ignis is there, two or one, probably two, but I'm not gonna risk it. We just need to do one transmutation. So we are doing water shard, that means we can we only need air. So instead we need we don't need water, that's why instead of sugarcane we can use uh, this grass. Hopefully it doesn't have like too much of aspect. But it should not uh, hurt us at all because we have a ton of mm, shit, and we are doing we are doing only one uh, recipe. To balance shard by this recipe. So here we go. Two terra, two perditio, two air, some herba, two ordo, some ignis, and we got balanced shard. And we can go ahead and throw more perditio. Actually, no. Yeah, I'd rather not mix because I can get any shard. I got moss stone, which is actually useful. Depending if uh, the aspects were changed, I don't know for sure, actually. You can change aspects, so it doesn't have uh, magic in it. Usually it does. So, just couple stone. One cotton and a balance shard. No! God damn it! That's bad. Why I didn't think about it? How do I nullify Terra from. Okay, I hope. I hope 
that NEI supports this. Yes, it does. So how do I see all crucible recipes? Recipes. Well, that's already a lot of recipes. Okay, so we can nullify all Terra by putting down a lot of water and throwing some clay in. And we know that clay will consume all Terra. So, oh, wow. If I <coughs> do four cobble, actually now more. God damn it. Actually, if we throw a lot of water, water will be there. Okay, first of all, let's just go and craft another primal shard from a water shard. So it's to, the, to this, two of these, and that's for air and um, where is that it was here okay cinder pearl is that it i think i'm not missing anything if we waste it <laughs> whatever if we waste it we waste it um so Oh, come on. I was short on cran uh, candleberries, candleberries, I forgot candleberries. Where are they? Do I have some candleberries here? Yes, I forgot candleberries. It's probably too late and I'm gonna waste another one. Shit. I knew it. Now we also produce a whole bunch of junk that we have to clear out. Nice. Just wait, wasted two shards here and a bunch of materials. Okay, now we certainly should remember what we need. Two candleberries. Two of these, two of these, and two cobble, and a water shard. Should give me balance shard. And how to get only Perdicio without any other primal aspects? We will figure out that later. How does it doesn't work? Oh, I think I know what might be the case. I have four of the stone right now, I noticed. Which means uh, that's another recipe that is interfering with the recipes I am doing. Let's get ingredients again. Which means that we have to throw ingredients in the correct order. Well, it's, it's probably like easy to figure out, but, but just by dropping. Um, this most stone as the last one uh, I mean the stone so I drop this first no it was opposite shit okay whatever we might need this stone yeah we made stone again instead of us useful thing well that's hard I need to Troll stone first, not last. Ah. 
candle berries something that has air with I don't know if it's one feather or two feather it doesn't matter oh shit okay um and ignis and for ease I'm gonna just clear this fucking cauldron from the garbage okay so let's go first yeah we made it we made it so we cleared cauldron we need something with perdito that only has perdito but doesn't have any other primal aspects what happens here uh what shadow metal straw golems infernal force entropic refining what transmutation entropic refining what I thought this, there should be something. Oh, I, I did just I just did research something. So next would be straw golems, and we need machina, and for machina we need two, and for two we need order. We have order, and other thing we need humans for humans we need this. We need Spiritus, for Spiritus we need Double Victus. Okay, so we're making one Victus. Um, perditio, Perditio. Seriously. What might have Perditio? Okay, there is no way I get Perditio. So we go to original plan. Not the original, but the previous plan. We get two Terra and two Ordo. And when we show Shard, we get Terra Shard instead of I mean, two Terra and two Perditio, and we get Terra Shard instead of Perditio Shard. And we can add another water in. With Sugarcane, we can add water in. And after we add water, we can use water and two Terra to double the clay. And it will leave cauldron with um, two perditio, one herba, and one air. This should work. So again, we are throwing two of these and these into cauldron. And then transmutating, I mean, alchemically duplicating clay. And after that we can go right away throw our balance shard so that that and doubling that why no how that's not correct Where is my shard? Do I don't understand something? Fuck. I forgot the seed.
Jesus we have this one then we need do this one of these and we can double the clay right let's double the clay add cotton and we got finally an entropy shard well that's hard without goggles without thermometer that's all much harder so now it should make life a little bit more easier if that will actually give me this entropy thing so we have double life here and actually just in time we really need a perdicio to get death and convert life and death and after we get we get um, that and then we need fire we also need this this motus and motus we need with victus so we need another victus after this three victus so let's see if will it will work and give me perdito i'm sure those guys should have perdito i'm surprised they didn't work oh, so let's let it go let it go by itself at least i got one potato seeds seed actually two but this one is bad so throw it, throw it away um, mutations here can actually produce things that are worse than you begin with I mean not mutations but how you do this shit increasing they can produce things that are worse compared to what you begin with oh, please maybe I should remove everything else and only leave this one perdicio I'm going to do it <laughs> whatever everything else we can add later on but this entropy shit I don't know like put it right on top Everything else we were getting getting anyway, like this Ordo and water and Ignis, except aqua. Ah, no, 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 except air. So we might leave air. Everything else is like we get it by default for some unknown reason, but we're not getting. Oh shit. Okay, I'll leave it like this and hope it will work. If not, I might place uh, that shit in, in other place if that doesn't work I guess we'll have to look for knowledge fragments um, so about animals I'm do this stack 17 what like for real no just this one head is different guess it feathers do not belong here really much i mean nothing belongs here because it's trash chest R random chest i don't know we can just put it all here actually ah no let let it be here i wish i knew what aspect salt has actually i could guess because it's uh, water and terra could be useful uh, i can't wait for this mm. 
We need death and destruction here. I guess I shouldn't really rely on this shit and instead... Okay, that's definitely not working. Everything else is giving me aspects super fast or... I'm not even sure how and why it works. We'll try and place it behind the table and no, we'll come back later. It's standing on a block that has Perdito in it. I don't have any better. I can't make compressed one. So yeah, animals, animals. So there's one chicken left because all chickens got angry and I killed all of them again, except small little bastard. I couldn't reach him because it was small, uh, small chicken. I, I don't know. I don't know how we call them chicks or whatever. Uh, <clears throat> And I went down to kill him with my fucking Nezrak shit. And I couldn't hit him because it was too small. He actually killed me. And after he killed me, he said, well, fine. Now I'm not angry anymore. And now, it, now he grew up. And I don't know why they get angry. Well, I, I made them all angry one time because I hit one of them with an egg because I tried to kill him actually because one of them was angry for no reason I think they get angry when you steal eggs or something I don't know, one was angry for no reason and eventually they all died in um, trying to chase me to the wall and they suffocate each other and they all died. But I have more than two stacks of uh, actual eggs. I'm a little bit afraid of using them so I hope that, we'll, that, that one chicken can reproduce. So those gardens do spread but that's exceptionally slow. It's so slow that doesn't allow me to have like research to understand how they is it biome specific or